Hello, viewers. This is International from Scooby Review. Bring you my 627 podcast. This is my 627 podcast. Like always, I'm gonna speak very loudly, very clearly, and very slowly. In, in, in case you don't understand me. Also, I try to do my best not to preach too hard during this art podcast recording as well, not to cost any art feedback as well. And finally, if you're under 18, this art podcast recording will change your adult language. Once again, if you're under 18, this art podcast recording will change your adult language. If you're under 18, now if you're over, if you're over 18, then you need to go this art podcast recording. So anyway, with this uh, out of the way, let's get into the topic of this podcast. Some recent news has broke. <laughs> Some recent news. Well, <laughs> recent news. What I mean by recent news, what I found out. <laughs> what I found out today that you know. That that Disney Plus is to, is doing a Gargoyles reboot in live action. So basically, so far the details of the show, uh, the details for this re- reboot is is pretty clear that the, everybody's like the so, um, the Gargoyles. It basically, it's gonna be like the basically or the Gargoyles uh, instead of uh, instead of you know the cult classic Disney cartoon Gargoyles. It's gonna be in live action, so basically all the gargoyles are gonna be in CG and live CG action and all that bullshit. Now, there's been a point that Keith David was. Now, this uh, you know the show winner for the show is not the it's not the creator of the it's not the creator of the of the gargoyles to so sell. They got some new guy named Kenneth something, <laughs> Kenneth Mc McPanic or some shit like that. I believe if I'm pronouncing his last name, but you know, you know, they said that this this he has you know has been thinking about uh, how to you know how to you know, how to bring back the this classic Disney, this classic Disney series, you know, for uh, been thinking about doing this, you know, doing this for a while, bringing back this classic, you know, this classic, this cult classic Disney cartoon back for a while. But you know, there was a whole big debate over should it be anime or live action. Now, now it, it's been, it's been, it's been, it's been, it's been, it's, been, it's kind of been for that Keith David has been, you know, has been talking to Disney, you know, been talking to Disney about this, you know, he, he said that, you know, and it basically, and, pre, and a lot of, you know, conventions about gargoyles, you know, if Disney does, you know, decide to, you know, bring back gargoyles, he, he, like, he, he always said, yes, I'll be down that. So basically Keith David is so why has kept silent, you know, ever since this news broke, but a lot of people, so basically, like, you know, a lot of, so basically, according to the showrunner, the showrunner for this live action gargoyle series, that, you know, you know, like, you know, he would like to get much of the, much of the Bush actors who play, who, that are still alive, who play the gargoyles, like, you know, like Lexington and all them who, who are still alive, just play to voice, to voice, to uh, voice the gargoyles, and, you know, and maybe do some motion capture as well. Now, this show, a lot of people are very skeptical about it turning a, turning this cult classic <laughs> from a cartoon series into a live action series. Cause honestly, look at the, look at how the live action teenage ninja turtle, the two live action teenage ninja turtle movies did with with Nickelodeon. So a lot of people thought like you know the CGI was you know it, it did not really you know respond to the CGI turtles very well. <laughs> so basically, a lot of people are worried that you know oh it's gonna be. You know the CGI might be might be a little janky, but you know, but the show would have compared, uh, but the show would uh, compared that the CGI will be on point. You know, it will be on point. As for when this show is supposed to come out, <laughs> the the, the uh, more more details will will, will follow uh, 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 
and uh, and, uh, and, uh, and you know we'll follow very soon. So basically, that the show one of the lot back in God will go and confirm that you know we're gonna bring back and we're gonna bring back most of um most of all the voice cat uh most of all the voice actors from the original series to participate in this live action series as well. So basically, like you know, uh, uh, so basically uh, that's something uh, that sounds like a good thing, but you know and. Uh, also be, and also and also be and also cast some uh, some of those you know who's gonna play but a lot of people wonder who's gonna play the who's gonna play who's gonna play the live action version of Lisa Martha detective Lisa Martha who's gonna play the live action version of David Zanatos and some of the other human characters from from the from the gargoyles from the gargoyle you know cartoon franchise but we just have to wait and see. So anyway, my my hope is I hope that the, the that the CGI for the gargoyles will be decent, you know, past, you know, you know, I like this year, you know, this year, you know, when it comes to uh, their shows, you know, especially when it comes to special effects, Disney does do a good job when it when it comes to the shows when it, when it comes to special effects. Depends on picked up what Disney show that, that you watch. But yeah, anyway, but I'm just hoping that this show will be decent. A lot of people would like to hear I like to hear um, uh, you know, I would like to hear Keith but I would really like to see Keith David, you know you know, as go go life again and whatnot, you know, and see how this turns out. So anyway, what do you guys think about this? You know, shit, shit what the, you know, and is it a good idea for Disney Plus to turn turn the Gargoyle cartoon series into a lot action one? Yes or no? Please let me know in the comments below. Anyway, signing off from Screen Views. One.